How does it feel off the bat to be ranked number one in the nation? <laughs> the boys wanted to be him and the ladies wanted him. Wow, wow look at this. Yes. So the cutest couple here. Do you love him? That was pretty atrocious if I say so myself. Recently ranked number one in the nation. Let's see his ice in his veins. What's up guys, Mitchell Pelkey back with another video. I'm out here at the beautiful McDonough School here in Maryland with the number one recruit in the 2025 class, my guy, Brendan Millen. What's up guys, I'm Brendan. I go here at McDonough, I'm a rising junior. I play attack, I'm ready to shoot with Mitch. Games, competitions, Q&A. We're gonna see how this guy lives and runs this school at McDonough. Let's dive in. First game is pig. We refer to it as lag. You guys know the rules, but let's get into it. Let's go. Let's go. Quick little intermission. Later this week, I am putting live the Mitchell Pelkey lacrosse experience powered by STX. Full cities are going live this week. Stay tuned on the Mitchell Pelkey website and my Instagram announcing the cities. I'll be traveling to New Jersey, Baltimore, Florida, and Texas. Signups are going to be quick. There's only a limited number of spots. Just be on the lookout. Registration opens this week. I don't remember if I beat McKay, but probably did. The young buck takes it. So I'm gonna let the young guy go first. I'm just gonna go crossbar from right here. Uh -oh. Those those orange lines. Oh. <laughs> he thought he could take my swag, son. He knows this is the first go-to for your boy. These are B Millie's balls. He bought a bunch of greasers, so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> crossbar. Oh! We'll take you guys over here. I think I'm gonna go from goal line. Right here. Just make it. Oh, no! Right here. This is tough. I don't think I've ever made this on my own channel. Oh, yeah. Kids got out, put it on the board. I'm just gonna go lefty underhand, top left corner. Oh, Folks, if he missed that, I probably wouldn't even have shot and just took the letter. Top right, shooting with the right, top left. Recently ranked number one in the nation. Let's see his ice in his veins. Oh my god. That was on the board for both of us. I think I might go with a stick change. It's all mental right now. I'm in his head. You know why actually? Probably because he's not rocking STX. Nah, shout out my ECD boys. <laughs> we go right here, right hand, top left. Wow! Folks, folks, folks. What men's league do you want the board to sign up at? Oh. Folks, the kids got two on the board. Anything you want to say to the camera? We're good. We're gonna do a little trickery. Don't know how good the kid's left hand is. We're gonna go over here behind the restraining box line. Left hand, nothing but net. Gotta hit the net board, it's the ground. Yep. Oh my god, just slipped it in there, folks. Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> That's it, folks. The kid, just like that. L to LAX. First cop of the day. Come so back. He's gotta go. He's switching back. Good job, though. Good yeah. job. We're gonna go on to the second cop. Goalie Wars. Do you wanna be in cage first or not? Yeah, I'll be in cage first. All right, folks. Suit up. Let's go. Not one to make excuses whatsoever, so stick has nothing to do with it. I mean, he played better than me. Simple as that. Without a doubt, I'm smoking. I'm not even worried. Are you looking? Yeah, he's looking. He's so ready. <laughs> <laughs> he's so ready. Yeah, shoot, shoot, shoot. <laughs> Damn. All right, over one, over one. Spin out to my right hand over here. Oh, no, he's there! Popcorn. Wow, okay, all right. Look at the stance, though. Folks, he looks like Scotty Rogers, yeah, no contacts across. Bingo! This is his name, folks. Roll out to my left hand, right? Oh! Mrs. Count, too, so that's one for four. I'm gonna be silent now, I'm chirping too much. I feel bad for him. Yep. Bingo. Bingo is his name, son. Bingo oh, is his name, son. The bouncer's on the turf. Three for six. Oh, he's right there! Oh, the All right, one more here to get four. Three for nine. You're nervous. Stay there, and I'm gonna use you as a screen. I'm right. gonna act like I'm running around you, right? All right. Oh my <laughs> camera man! <laughs> that was terrible. I'm not mad about three for ten. Uh, you think it's harder than it is? Let me pop the dome on, we'll switch it up. He's gonna shoot now. Let's go. You ready? Yeah, let's go. How's his stance there? Look at the goalie frog. Oh. Hey, buy your merch, MitchellBelky.com. Starting off right, we'll sidearm bouncer. <laughs> Soak it. The Italian legs, baby. Over one. Did he go like that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Bing bang. Here we got a little twister trying to confuse him with the release. Oh, that actually got me. I, I raised there a bit. Runaway left hand, far pipe, offside hip. No. Oh. I'm gonna try and go five hole here. Keep the head high. Yeah, there we go. One for four. I'm gonna fake on the left again, and I'm gonna go back to the right. Far side pipe. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Off the shaft. Hey, this is why you rep the best lacrosse company in the world, STX. Brandon will tell you. Yeah, I won't tell you. 
that stance. That, that, that form. I'm gonna go offside hip here. I think he's slow to that side, so. Yeah, didn't even move there. I'm gonna get in his head now. I'm gonna stare, same spot I just shot at, and I'm gonna pull it to the other side. Play. Let's go, let's go. Hit me in the shoulder, deflect it. Bog Hans running up the field with it. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna give him a little underhand riser and try and put this top right. Wow, that's a good save. No, it's his name, son. All right, hey, two for eight. Make the rest of you win. You don't, potentially tie, we'll lose. Of course, uh, yeah. He's not gonna get there. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Tied up right now. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go for a little spin oh, around shovel again. shot. <laughs> no. Easy. That's it, all right. Hey, tied up. You're rolling for OT, OT. Three shots. Look at the hair. I oh, know, the hair probably looks terrible. Three shots? We can pick the start. The person that makes it the most wins. You want to start or you want to hop in cage? I'll hop in cage. I got something in for him. We're going to go lefty, roll out to the right, top right. <laughs> Man, the kid's going to his lefty in overtime. He's scored one lefty goal my whole career. Is he back yet? Or? Yeah, he's nice he's still there. He's, still he's there. back, he's back, he's back. <laughs> Oh no! The pipe! I gotta get at least one on the board here. This is embarrassing. Right there. Bogon! <laughs> Not done yet, alright? I'm just gonna go with right side, head high, low to low. Here we go, deception. Oh, no, I was there! I was there! Golly! Gotta give it to the guy in overtime. Yeah. How we feeling? How we feeling? Good game. A little vengeance for that. A little vengeance. Hey, but guess what? One to one. We got one competition left. Nothing but net. You ever played? Yeah. This will crown the champion here on, uh, what's this field called? W. Bolton Dixon Field. W. Bolton Dixon Field. Shout out to you. You're legend. Nothing but net. Game three. Let's go. Five yards. Nothing but net. Woo! Ten yards. Playing the speed game or is it going accuracy? I think it would play better in goalie wars if we didn't bring out these greasers, but we're gonna go 15 yards. Ah, uh, bingo is his name, son. 41! 20 yards here. This is where O'Neal got out, actually. Bingo is his name, son. Was it the white line? Yeah, yeah. You're over. Was I? You're over. Right there. Absolutely. We got no reps out here. Matty P isn't out here. Yeah, there we go. All right, 25 yards. Bingo is his name, son. That's it, folks, that's it. Crown the champion. We got Millen out here bringing greasy balls. This is sad to say. What do you got to say? Definitely could have performed better in the yeah, yeah, That yeah. was pretty atrocious if I say so myself. Um, I think Pelkey might be 2-0 against the Millen brothers out here on the Bolton Dixon field. No way. That. <laughs> I love it though. All right, we're gonna keep this thing going. We're gonna see how he lives inside the building. Facilities, tours, see the weight room, locker room. You ready? Yeah, let's, let's go. Let's do it. This is our athletic building, Ron's Luke Meyer Athletic Center. That's where we have our weight room, locker rooms, all that good stuff. So let's get into the tour. Here we got our weight room. In here a lot in the off season. Mainly on our own in the fall and then in the winter we get in here as a team and we're in here getting after, getting ready for the spring. What are the team lifts like? We got music going on the speakers. We got EDM, hip hop. Kind of varies a lot. I mean, definitely a lot of EDM, a bunch of mixes. But yeah, we get workouts written up by our awesome trainers on the boards, hit those and then most of the time go out to practice. Who we got back here? He's working out in the khaki pants. Hayden Holmes right here, Rising Junior. He's on varsity. Yeah. Nice What's to meet up, you, Mitchell. Me. Looking pretty jacked. What's it like working out with this guy? It's always fun, always like team workouts, always good time like you said music blast and just like everyone together like winter workouts always a good time favorite the workout bus. in here that you like to hit i'd probably say over there curls incline yeah do we have a, we have a girlfriend yes we do let's go give her a shout uh, out might see her today oh uh, okay amanda lawson that's my girlfriend do you love her i do love her. Well, i love yeah. that man right, so this school is not even close to riverside that kind of reminds me of ohio state a little bit they have a pool in their high school this is our pool area i've been here a bunch of times when i'm injured getting in some pool workouts lightweight on the feet and ankles so is my brother and so do the trainers the trainers have people in here a lot swimming we have a great swimming team, boys and girls. Always successful, always winning championships. You ever so. think about joining the swim team? Nah. <laughs> Water polo looks fun though. Polo Mark looks looked really like he was a swimmer back in the day. I don't know about that. McDonough has the campus. They're providing everything. What resource does this school not have? I think they got everything. Yeah, literally. I'm, I'm happy with this place. I love <laughs> exactly. It. All right, let's keep going. This place is really special. As you can see, all the way to the right. 2016. I'm in this building a lot, always walking by this. We've worked really hard for him, and it's kind of good to just have this up so we're always walking by it. I love that. Yo, interview? Come on. 
Name and occupation? Luke Miller, student athlete. The Luke Miller. Where are we going? No, no, no. Okay, okay. With, uh, with my friend Ben over here. Okay, we'll see. Little teaser, little, little teaser. teaser. How are we feeling though? What's it like playing with this cat out in the field? This cat's an absolute dog. It's really fun. He's an average practice player at best interesting, though. Interesting, interesting, yeah. interesting. Yeah. Always going against this guy in practice, <laughs> playing with him in games. So, you know, a bunch of chirping going on in practice, but it's always casual, nice. Casual, 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 casual chirp. All the Mitchell Pelgy subscribers about LM1. Ladies, Instagram, Snapchat, you name it. Just hit me up, please. Hit him. He's single, ready to mingle, folks. Sing, uh, yeah. Yeah, sort of, but so, yeah. Here we got our upstairs gym. Down there we have a couple courts, but this is our main gym for our basketball team. Always nice, those stands drop down. Go to those over there and those How over there. How many volleyball games have you gone to in your career? Zero. Zero, really? Yeah, I'm pretty busy in the fall. I think the fans want to see though. Give us one shot. Give us a three-pointer on the main hoop. One shot, you're hearing a lot. Mm. Oh, 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 oh. Folks, folks, the form is there. All right, let's see it, last shot, three-pointer. Wide up, go. You guys will see the commitment here coming soon. Could potentially be a two-sport athlete at the next level. Hey, we'll find out. Here we got all of our previous captains for the lacrosse team. This is just a pretty special spot because it just shows the history and the amount of unbelievable players that have come through this school. Got my brother right there. We got a bunch of other legends. All those guys, you know, I mean, I look up to them. I've been at the school since sixth grade, so I grew up watching a lot of these guys. So it's just kind of cool to hopefully try and be up there one day and have that as a goal. This is really cool. It kind of just shows you, like, at the end of the day, you know, if you want to play at the next level, like being a captain and having that leadership role is super big for the colleges and, and during the recruiting process. And I Obviously, when he gets to the next level, to show that leadership on and off the field is super important. So let's keep this yeah. thing rolling. The kid that locks down the cage here for the Eagles. Introduce yourself for the fans. Uh, in Cybul, goalie at the McDonough School. The Ohio State, the McDonough School. What can we expect out of the Eagles this spring? I think we got some dogs. Got some dogs in the kennel, and they'll be firing. Yeah, got a lot of returners. Got some new guys coming up to step up. So we yeah. should have a lot of success. And what does this guy mean to us? We line up outside the training room in there. Everyone walks out. Everyone stops right here. Seniors and captains touch it first, and then uh, everyone goes out. That's a little tradition. Yeah. And Obviously, we have the field. It's definitely unique, obviously. One of the only grass fields in the MIA. Beautiful stadium, beautiful uh, stands. It's always nice playing there, and a lot of the time, we get it pretty packed. Sweet. First couple of days on campus for you, introduce yourself with the fans. My name's Eli Schaller. Bogue Han. First week here. Who's been showing you the ropes? <laughs> Brandon and Bogue have been awesome. A few of their friends, James Tolker, big shout out to yeah. him. Hi, I'm Amanda. Bogue just said you guys are the cutest couple in school. Is that, is that true? Thanks, yeah. Bogue. Yeah. yeah. Bogue, is that, thanks. Is that, what's this guy like in school? He's a good kid, has fun, works hard, does homework. Does homework, does homework. How long have you guys been dating, actually? Four, Four months. months. Four months! Uh -huh. Big last name, big guy around yeah. town. Would you say you pull more weight in the relationship or he does? Yeah, I definitely wear the pants. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. I like yeah. that. Yeah, I know he has like a big name, but I still wear them sometimes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Goes back and forth. Last thing, do you love him? Yes! Wow. Wow, look at this. Yes. So the cutest couple here. Okay, babe, let's go. <laughs> So here we got our middle school, recently built two or three years ago. Super new and really, really nice. So let's go. Here we are in the lobby. We got the library right there. Marlene and Stuart Greenbaum, they had a hefty donation to make this middle school possible. Took a little while to get built, but it was definitely worth the wait. Here we got Mr. Spencer, seventh grade Spanish teacher. Goofed off in his class a little bit, but you know, he got me into place. Here he is. What was B. Millie like in the classroom? I think he just hit the nail on the head. Was he talking to a lot of females in class? He had some mad riz. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mad riz. The boys wanted to be him and and the ladies wanted him. Wow. 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 Seventh and eighth grade lacrosse coach. I taught him everything he knows. What quote, a couple tips about life that you can give them? Attitude and effort. Some things are beyond your control. Attitude and effort are always within your control. You show up, you have a great attitude, you hustle, you work hard, you do those two things, yeah. coaches will find you. I love that. Put it on a t-shirt and learn Spanish. And always, always, always. Spanish. Always, Spanish. always Spanish. 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 the world, right? Sweet. Uh, it's our old library and our old mission building. And then in front of us, we have Allen Building. We have our theater in there. It's called Horn Theater. Just had an assembly in there today. This is kind of where we have more of our English history and those types of classes. And then I don't know if you can see over there, but that's more of our math and science building. I do have to say though, touring this place right now, this has to be some colleges out there. The campus of this place is huge. Some colleges that have like 5,000 students or less, definitely smaller than a place like this. All right, so here we are in the lobby of the Allen Building. Here we have more English. Allen, not Craig Allen. I'm Craig Allen, buddy. Craig Allen, Craig Allen. No, 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 no. Honey, honey. Favorite Just class right now, what do you got? I like history. I really like history, and this year I'm taking U.S. history, and I really like U.S. history. Interesting. I love it. I hated history, so that works out perfect. Let's go. <laughs> 
Wow, this brings yeah. back some memories right here. See, the Buckeye way would be out in front. I'd be sitting in that chair right there. Yeah. I would have no hat, pencil and paper out, taking notes. Brad Crowd himself, academic weapon. This feels good to be back though, I'm not gonna yeah. lie. Are you ready to be done or are you enjoying the moment? Yeah, definitely enjoying the moment. It's kind of crazy that I'm already a junior. But yeah, I mean, I, I've been enjoying school. I mean, everyone that I've talked to said like being an upperclassman is like the best. Yeah. That's when school is the most fun. So I'm really looking forward to this year and enjoying it. Sweet. All right. We're out here with Coach Hillgarden. He's got the laptop open. This is the office of where things go down. Can you give us a little tour? This is my desk. It's very messy. It's a five-year goal I have to clean this off. Five We're in years. Year. Pictures of my advisees. We got James Brown over here. Legend. Our conduct's the best proof of character. I like that. Okay. A couple former players up there on the wall. The netting up there from a couple championships. There we go. I like that. Something like that. What can we expect out of the Eagles this spring? We got a long way to go before we get there, Mitch. A long way to go. Uh, what I'm expecting out of the Eagles is a great fall, playing wow. a lot of different sports, working out getting better, doing well in the classroom, and then coming out ready to get after it in the spring. I like that. We took a little tour of the uh, weight room. Coach Hilgarden ever get up in there with a little tank top, maybe the, the oh, classic yeah. rock going or anything? Oh yeah, Coach Hilgarden. Little, little something, something. Little something. Little something. Little something. <laughs> you gotta keep up with uh, Rick Pelkey. Yeah, you know, exactly. So. <laughs> so here we got a beautiful dining hall, a bunch of seating. You don't have to sit anywhere, but freshman normally over there. Sophomore year, I sat all the way at the end down there with my buddies. This year, we're all the way in that corner, and then seniors are kind of over there, and then these round tables, people just kind of sit wherever. Lunch is always a good time, great place. So this area is great, this is our quad. We, you see we got a bunch of chairs out here. Life at McDonough in the spring is unreal. Spending free periods out here in the beautiful weather. All your friends are out here. You see we got spike ball. It imagine is. going to St. Mary's in the spring. Could you imagine it? I couldn't imagine could, that. You wouldn't even you know, send your kids there. You wouldn't even no. send your enemy's kids there. <laughs> no, probably not. Oh, all right, made it to the deep end of the video. We're out here. How does it feel off the bat to be ranked number one in the nation? It's unreal. It's a goal that I started before the spring. Wasn't really too focused on it. I'm obviously more focused on winning another championship, but I mean, it's just kind of something I've had in the back of my mind and something I've kind of wanted and it's really nice to have all your hard work pay off for team goals that you've reached but when it's for yourself it's pretty nice too so it's great to go up there with some of the really incredible names that have been ranked before me number one really proud of myself and just really appreciative of the people that ranked me there are we switching to nine or are we staying 41 yes sir of course we're going to nine I've always worn nine for my dad he's kind of been my role model as I've grown up so I'm switching to nine next year and I can't wait to be wearing that nine orange and black has anybody in the MIAA ever done a four P? I don't I don't think that's been done before. <laughs> we obviously met your beautiful girlfriend. Give us a rose and a thorn about her. I'd say a rose is, I just think she does genuinely love me and care for me. Thorn? I don't want to get killed. I'd say she's a little bit slow sometimes. Oh, interesting. She's a very smart girl. She's She has very good grades. She's going to Stanford for lacrosse, but sometimes it takes her a little bit to process things, but that's all right. And last question, and some of these guys at McDonough don't have girlfriends, is it because they're not buying any Mitchell Pelkey merchandise? I think that absolutely could be in the mix. I think maybe six or seven months ago, I bought a bunch of Mitchell Pelkey yeah. merch. And look at him now. Got a text right away and the text started rolling in. And that's where I found my girl. First shot since losing and hanging the cleats in the rafters. Oh! Kids still got it!